Yoyo was the cheat, so today we're going to be basically doing the URL for image and we're going to be passing in the properties over here. So basically, let's get to it. All right, so you go into URL for images and in this URL for images.javascript, we're basically going to create this file. And I'm going to leave the code link in the description. All right, afterwards, we're just going to go into our index. Let me just uh, go back and explain what we're doing over here, all right? So what I did basically is just I changed a little bit of the naming over here, all right? And then I just made a component for the header, all right? And I mapped over some properties over here, and basically I'm going to show you what we did, all right? So. For example, we have the articles over here, which is the article string. If we debug it over here, it's going to show us some properties. So if, uh, for example, if this type the category string that we did in the previous video. All right, but we're not going to map over this. We're going to map over the, the await itself. All right. And then we're gonna pass in some properties. And then basically we're gonna show off over here some of the articles, all right? So some of the properties that are done over here in this video are here. If we remove it, for example, it is gonna work, but it is not gonna be defined. So we can just add this properties. And in the next video, we're gonna be talking about the dynamic route. All right, so you can check out the video for reference to do a simple task like this. This is basically, uh, we're going to use the URL for image in terms of the image source. All right. That's why I asked you to do the file at the beginning of the video. Then we're going to map over the categories, then we're going to map over the articles. All right. And then we're going to pass in properties to show the each article property. And in the next video, like I said, we're gonna be talking about dynamic routes.